In today's video, we're answering the question, why mutes? What's going on everyone? My name is Josh Brzezepka and today is Mute Monday. If you're new around here, Mute Monday is a weekly series where I discuss and demonstrate different trumpet mutes. In today's video, we are asking the question, why mutes? Uh, why should we have them? Why should we care about them? Now, I guess I could have asked this question uh, a long time ago when I started Mute Monday. This is episode 34, so I've discussed well over 100 different trumpet mutes and I've demonstrated them and I've talked about what makes them unique, but I haven't really talked about why we should care about mutes. What is it about mutes that make them so unique and how does that impact us as trumpet players and musicians? Well, let me start off with this. In the music world, the trumpet is so unique just because of trumpet mutes. And sure, we have all the different trumpets, B flat, C trumpet, piccolo trumpet, cornet, flughorn. However, the mutes really set the trumpet apart from practically every other wind instrument and certainly the string instruments. And uh, let me explain why. We can play open, and then we have access to this entire uh, ecosystem, this whole world of different sounds by using trumpet mutes. Think about that for a moment. The only other instruments that readily come to mind that can do that uh, are a keyboard, a digital keyboard, uh, and then a guitar if you've got lots of different pedals. With the trumpet, we can do the exact same thing. We can change our sound. Now, a flute player can't do that. Clarinet player can't do that. Violin player, cello, all of the different woodwinds, all of the different string instruments, they can't do that without digital assistance, without having something that they plug into that then gives them a new sound. And in the brass world, sure, some of the other brass instruments, uh, they have access to mutes, but they don't have as great a variety of mutes, and they don't really quite work as well as they do on the trumpet. The register of the trumpet, that is how low we can play and how high we can play, uh, it's in a very vocal range, and just the design of the trumpet, so many factors, they all came together, and because of that, we have such a wide range of different sounds that we can access just by sticking something in the bell. And this week, I was inspired to do a video on this topic after an old friend of mine, a fantastic jazz trumpeter, Dominic Farron, uh, reached out to me and sent me a message asking about different mutes and he was looking for buzz sounds and really unique trumpet sounds and he knew what he was looking for but he wasn't really quite sure uh, which mutes were out there and and what was available and that got me thinking it's like the trumpet we are so unique because we have access to an entire library of new sounds. You just put it in the bell and you've got a new sound. And that is the big why about mutes. Sure, some of the mutes out there are more utilitarian than others, like a practice mute where it is really just designed uh, to make the trumpet softer. However, we have so many different mutes, from straight mutes, to cup mutes, to harmony mutes, to practice mutes, to bucket mutes, to uh, felt mutes, and hat mutes, and pixie mutes, and buzz mutes, and wah mutes. The list goes on and on. And that's why I think it's so important that we really build collections and that we accumulate a fair number of mutes. You don't have to be crazy. You don't have to be like me and have 200 of them. But if you've got a dozen, if you've got 20, if you've got 30, uh, you are going to be so well prepared. And I'm just happy to be contributing to the trumpet community and hopefully opening up people's ears. Uh, if I can open up different trumpet players' ears and the ears of different composers, well, that means we're going to have new and exciting mutes and we're going to have new and exciting music. Uh, so really just a win-win. But don't forget how lucky we are as trumpet players. The fact that we can play all these different mutes, that we can just buy a mute and stick it in our bell and get a brand new sound. That is impossible with so many instruments out there. They don't have that luxury. So that is something to consider if you hadn't really thought of mutes in that sense. Uh, so many people just think of a mute as something they stick in the bell because that's what's on the part. But it is so much more than that. And that's why I love mutes and that's why I love sharing them with all of you. Now hopefully this has gotten you to think about mutes a little bit differently and realize that that we trumpet players, we really have got it great. And maybe you'll go buy a couple new mutes and try out some new sounds. And as you build your collection and you get comfortable with how they sound, it is just gonna open up new musical possibilities for you and new sounds and new combinations that you may not have considered previously. And I think that is just so much fun and it makes playing music even more exciting. Well, that is my answer to the question, why mutes? Uh, I'd love to hear what you think about it. Let me know in the comments below. And while you're at it, hit that like button and make sure to subscribe. 
want to thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.